Today we have mayonnaise that is almost 10 years out of date. I'm pretty sure mayonnaise is supposed to be some form of white. What are you on about? <laughs> this is incredible. Yeah, we had to do some research, well you did some research, to find out if we ate this, would we die? It's been in a sealed packet, so mm. apparently mayonnaise is um, one of the best foods, the purest foods that doesn't form bacteria. So I don't know why you uh trusted anything I've researched. I'll tell you one thing though, it's very difficult to find out what 10 year old packet of mayonnaise with lime and chilli can do to your stomach. We keep rolling the dice of death on this channel and uh, yeah, I just think one day we're going to eat something that's not good for us and it's going to kill us and I think this might be it. Anyway, we got a letter. Yes, this was sent to us. Do you want to read it? Because like I've read this a few times to make yeah, sure. Because so this got properly. this got lost in my um, cupboard because we moved to uh, a new place to do filming, and then I had a load of stuff sent to me, and I just filed it away, and this got lost, and I found it recently. Now I apologise to the person who sent this to us because I am a hundred percent sure they don't watch the channel anymore. <laughs> hundred percent sure. Hello to the guys at Where's My Challenge. This letter contains a sealed sachet of mayonnaise that is around seven years old and five years past expiry. Hope you guys give it a try as I would love to know how it tastes. Enjoy. We couldn't find your Twitter handle. We looked it up. I remember having this in-depth conversation about it so I can't wait to see it. I think, I'm pretty sure it was on Twitter. He said it was about seven years old. This is now well over ten years old. It's been a few years since we got sent that. Some things that we do you just can't research because <laughs> some people have never been stupid enough to do it and we're the first. So we are like guinea pigs, human guinea pigs. Mate, it is like popping little bit of, bits of jelly pearls in my hands. I've got to stop messing around with that because it's creeping well, me out. Mayonnaise traditionally goes bad uh, if you've opened it and exposed it to air. This has never been exposed to air. But it's gone bad. I don't know if I got like a jar of mayonnaise and just hid it in my attic for 10 years so what'll happen. See you guys in 10 years for that one. <laughs> smells very vinegary. <laughs> Did not expect it to smell like that. It looks like Branson pickle, not Branston uh mayonnaise so I'm just gonna pour that it's mayonnaise people due to health and safety reasons and so on uh, <laughs> I don't really want to swallow this I think we're gonna do uh, a taste test yes I think that's post to okay. swallow it because some like with these things normally on YouTube people just open them and look at them no one's stupid enough to eat them this is definitely one that I'm not swallowing. I like, I don't care if anyone's gonna poop on me for that. Well, to poop be poop away. To be fair, if you handed that to someone and they were going, "Oh, you didn't swallow it," and you go, "Go on then, swallow then," i was just like, nine times out of ten, I don't think there be. There might be a couple of people out there who are silly enough to think it's a good idea to swallow that, but it's not even a good idea to put in your mouth. That little bit of drip of oil then as well. Are you ready? Not really, mate. Honest... We're, def we're definitely spitting this out, right? 100% spitting it out. I'm not. This is where I'll swallow it with a hard pussy and I'll die. <laughs> Three, two, one. <laughs> Your lip is quivering. What's going on? <coughs> You've got an eye. Eating that after seeing that. 
It's got a texture of cottage cheese. Oh. <coughs> Blimey. Core blimey, governor. That. Do you swallow it? No. <laughs> I think we're going to be wretching all day. Did you, did you get the um, texture? Well, I was on that. I was rubbing. I put it the drop on my tongue and rubbed it across the roof of it. Might be one of the worst old things I've ever tasted. That used to be egg. <laughs> That's what I'm, I'm like. Egg. Isn't it funny to think the chicken that made that's dead now? See how long you can hold it under your nose, like... <laughs> uh, well, yeah, like the video. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, make sure to go and check out the description. We have loads of other videos there as well. We've done a... a I'm going to cut old... my tongue off. <laughs> We've done a lot of old food over the Christmas period, just to try and get a lot of the decent stuff we had left over done and out of the way. Uh, yeah, when I found this, I was like, we have to do this soon because it's just so gross. I don't want to ruin the taste of mayonnaise forever. Would you like to... No, oh, uh, yeah, all right. Let's... Have a quick spoon of the real... Well, it's not the real stuff, it's light, because I'm fat. <laughs> just I want... to clear the, the palate and, and remind us that mayonnaise is nice. Not all mayonnaise is bad. Yeah. Now that's mayonnaise. No. Really? No? What's, the, is that one worse? I once did a video for Where's My Chance where I tried to eat an entire big jar of mayonnaise and vomited everywhere. I was one mouthful away from completing it. <laughs> Not been able to eat mayonnaise like that since. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, like, favourite, and subscribe. And if you subscribe first from now on, done something stupid like eating super old mayonnaise uh, that we got sent to us by a fan who definitely doesn't watch the channel anymore. And it doesn't have a Twitter account or anything, so thank you, sir, for sending this to us. Maybe one day you'll check out our channel and go, do you know what, one of those idiots ever did do my mayonnaise, you know, every year. We did, is the answer, but about, about five years later. <laughs> uh, goodbye, everyone.